Hi, it's Dale. Last video I did, we covered uh, triggering a relay with a ground. And today we're going to cover uh, triggering it with a positive 12 volts. I'm going to, I'm still using my fan as a reference uh, on this one because just because I kind of had everything here. Uh, there are some fans that do use a, a positive to turn them on. Plus, uh, uh, I have a 66 Ford F100 with C6 in it. And I have a cooling fan on my transmission cooler. And I only run that fan as if, if I'm in a cruise or getting heavy traffic somewhere. I'll turn it on. Otherwise, I don't want it running. So I just have a switch on the dash, turn it on and off, rather than having a, a, a temp sensor do it for me. So that's a good a, a, a good point of having to use a switch for the fan so with that uh we'll cover this really quick you see on this on the fan you could replace that with a, with whatever you want to turn on the idea uh is of running a relay in most instances with a positive switch is so you, you don't have to have a switch in the dash that'll that'll cover the amount of amperage of something that you're running. So say if you've got a cooling fan and it's using 25 amps, you don't need a 25 amp uh, switch in the dash and, and heavy wire going to it. You can use, use light gauge wire and a, a, a nice light switch and put it in the dash and the relay will handle the amperage going across it. Okay, so right here... What we got is uh, we got number 30, and it's going to go to our fuse or our circuit breaker. This particular one I'm doing right now, I'm going to a 30 amp circuit breaker. Here we're going to have a, a switch that's going to turn a plus 12 volts on to number 86. Okay, number 87 is going to go out to our fan or whatever you're going to run, you know, lights or whatever it may be. And the 85 just goes directly to a ground. 87A again is not used. If you were to use 87A, you'd take your wire from 87, you put an 87A, and then the fan would be running all the time until the switch was turned on, and then that turn the fan off. That's what that's for. So uh, generally in automotive, you almost always use 87, you know, 87A, uh, uh, maybe in an alarm system or something like that. So that's what we got. Um, let me grab the relay holder here and show you on it real quick so we got get this down where it belongs there we go uh here we got uh 87 on this one that's going to the fan and say 87a is empty right there in the middle number 86 is going to go to my toggle switch and Number 30 is going out to my circuit 30 amp circuit breaker. And uh, this is number 85, which goes directly to ground. So when I throw the switch, it triggers the relay and it takes our heavy gauge uh, hot wire right here and it's, it turns, triggers that relay. So it sends that 12 volts through. To this red wire right here which goes out to my fan now like i say again that could you could be triggering anything you want anything you want to want to put a relay on and you want to trigger it do it um there's certain things i don't recommend it for we'll cover that at a later later date when we start covering uh wiring up circuits so turn my camera here a little bit so i can see the switch so i just got my switch wired in to an on and off so as soon as I throw the switch, it will activate. Oh, say, why is it not going on? That's eh, because I didn't plug in the relay. That might be a good idea. Okay, so that activates my fan. Turn on whatever you wanted. So then as soon as I turn that off, fan is, is off. So I say, whatever, whatever you're wanting to trigger, that's all you need to do is right there so i think uh that was pretty quick and simple 
And if you got any questions, just put them down in the comments. I'll try to keep up on that as best as I can. And if you got any suggestions for stuff that you want to see on this channel, uh, tell me. You know, as long as it's automotive related, um, I'll do it. I don't do politics. <laughs> so uh, with that, I'm going to uh, hang this up and uh, put her on the, on the Internet. So don't forget to subscribe so you can uh, keep, getting, uh, keep getting my videos as I put them out. And uh, hit that hit that bell if you if you want to get notified each time I put a, a video out, and uh, and hit the like button just to keep YouTube happy with me. So if you do that, appreciate it. Thanks again for watching. Have a very blessed day.